Hello folks and welcome back to Bioshock 2 Remastered and uh, we're going to carry on with the Minerva's Den DLC. I'm sorry it's been so long since the last video of this. I really, I started this series at a really bad time. It was right before a sort of unplanned vacation for a couple of weeks. So yeah, it's been a while since the, the first episode. But if you missed that, I would recommend checking that out first so you can get the uh, entire context for what we're doing in this DLC. All right, so we were moving on to the operations area of my nervous den. Let's go. Operations, you're nearing the heart of the machine. Okay, so three little sisters again. Visitors to Minerva's Den are reminded that the operations wing of Rapture Central Computing is strictly off limits. Okay. Oh, what was the ammo situation? Not very good, was it? Oh my. Alright, looks like we're gonna do some drill bashing for a little while. Sigma! You show such loyalty to a proven traitor! What is Porter to you? A convenient excuse to disrupt my work? Or something... more? I am curious, I must admit. But not enough to let you live. I recognize this guy's voice so much. Is it the same guy that was in, uh, that was the Russian... Mafia guy in, uh, Sons of Anarchy? I feel like that's who that is. Voice is really familiar. Oh boy. Hold on. That work? Okay. What's the other one? Like to have some friends. Is there another? Oh. Damn it. All right, we're off to a rough start. I've got a bathosphere at my lab that should be able to get us the hell out of Rapture, but we can't launch just yet. First, we'll need to reprogram a signal beacon. That nutcase lamb's got the city on lockdown, but a hacked beacon should keep her torpedoes at bay. Ooh. See what you can... Upgraded ribbon gun. Fine. Cool. More vacuum bots. Yeah, I didn't destroy them all last time. Uh, like I think... Oh, Kenneth and, uh, Ava. Okay. Like I think I said in the first video, I'm not really worried too much about 100%ing this. Just kind of trying to pick up the story and have some fun. Without worrying too much about being OCD with the stuff. Damn you, don't don't you dare go heal. Alright. Oh hi. You wanna come out into the water here? Oh great. Spear gun is pretty effective. It lacks any go oh, it really lacks any sort of impact sound. Alright, there we go. Oh, is there a camera? Oh, there is. <sighs> Operations manager's office. Did I miss the camera? What? How did I miss it twice? more things on my side, the better. Ain't going there yet. Let's repair these guys. Oh, 
Okay. Yeah, there is some weird sound stuff. I think that was in the main game, too, where certain things kind of just don't register. I really need to go get some supplies, because if I run into a big daddy like this, it's going to be one hell of a fight. Hogarth, the bot. All right. Hey, Felix. I hear Porter is really happy about the new trajectory calculation routine. You know, the one that we worked on for six months? The one you took all the credit for? Oh, that reminds me. If you're looking for the key to your brand new office, you might want to check in the Circus of Values down the hall. Hope you brought your milk money, asshole. He put it... Okay, he put a key I need in the, uh, actual vendor. Some of the boys in the code pit whipped up a real doozy of an entertainment. Monitor screen hooked into a sort of tiny airplane cockpit, yeah? And that's swell, because what shows up on screen is an X, that's you, and a bunch of O's, like a Spitfire surrounded by a squadron of Jap Zeros. You fly your little X around and shoot them down one after another. The wall caught us at it one night, called it a waste of time. I don't know. On balance, ain't it better to change what's on the screen than just stare at it? Sorry, I don't really have a whole lot of commentary yet. Um, not a lot to talk about, I guess. Input of audio data into the thinker's database. Subject, Pearl Porter. I want to tell the recorder how we met, Milton. Okay, sure. I was working in my family's diner. School was starting for the fall. And one morning, in walks this college boy. Clean cut. First thing I noticed was his eyes. He sat down and ordered bacon, eggs, and coffee. He was shy, but we talked a little off and on. He came in every single morning for breakfast and ordered the same thing. I told my mama, that boy must really love... I don't see a key. I'm not sure what he was talking about. Was it the other one? Just didn't see it? Of your cooking. She said, he isn't coming in for the food, honey. He's coming in for you. A year later, we were married. Oh. Great, so to get the uh, office key, I need $250. That's stuff I need to spend on supplies, because I'm getting way more enemies than there is supplies so far. Alright, so let's do a health upgrade. Eve upgrade, another health upgrade. Nice. Some searching, I made contact with Charles Milton Porter in Minerva's death. A productive exchange. Clearly, Rapture is no place to continue my research. But Porter says that if he can find a way to return to the surface along with the programming for his mainframe, we could then rebuild the machine and work together towards the cure. I have located an Alpha series to assist him, Subject Sigma. The seafloor outside Minerva's den is a machine graveyard. With a little luck, you should find the beacon we need out there. I must keep an eye on Porter and his thinking machine. There's more than one way to muscle out a rival, and I suspect that Fontaine is vying for market dominance in computing now as well. Each hour, that contraption spends crunching genetic code for Fontaine, brings my city one step closer to dissolution. And if Porter should begin dancing to that hoodlum's tune, well, the machine is a marvel, invaluable. The man may prove obsolete. Some damn fool stuck his finger in the socket. To get out through the airlock, you'll have to break the circuit somehow. Any chance I can 
Oh. Okay. All I had, did I hit him with a pair of glasses? All I had to do was just hit him. Thought I was gonna have to move him with the. Uh... All oh, right, these guys can't go outside. Uh, I guess I can just deactivate them in here. I figured out how to reprogram a bathysphere signal beacon to scramble Lamb's torpedoes, but I need access to a bathysphere, and Porter's got the only one in the den locked away at his private dock. Son of a bitch! Why doesn't he open up? Okay, I wasn't expecting to go back outside. Look for a downed bathysphere. They each had a signal beacon we could use. Sure thing. Oh my. I love the out outside sections in the Bioshock games. They're all pretty linear, so I mean, it's not going to be too hard to find what I'm looking for, I don't think, but... Part of a ship. Make yourself at home, Sigma. Soon you also will be rusting here among the trash, used up by Porter and tossed on the heap. Okay. That'll do the trick. Take the beacon to the master input console in the programming wing. That paranoid bastard Wall had it installed in his office. Figured I had to get back in there. Question is, do I need to buy the key to get into that guy's office before I can get into Wall's office? Surprise, Sigma! Surprise what? What are you talking about? Let me guess, a flood of enemies. Oh. Okay, let's turn our little friends back on here. Oh. Oh no, not a turret. Oops. There we go. Oh, don't you guys get killed on me? Oh, there's another one. I didn't see that. Okay, you guys can... Oh, well, that works too, I guess. See that before? Someone there? Let's fix your oh, here we go again. You go? Let's let them fight for a minute. Let's see, oh, we're not. I like how they just come after me. Okay, so we should probably just go ahead and deal with the little sister right now. Thermal. I don't have much thermal cells. This is gonna suck. However... Ah, what the... Look out, you bot! Jeez. What a mess. I hate how when you start shooting them, the, um, the effect of them being shocked wears off. My goodness. Whew. That took forever. Okay. So, should we just... There's only two gathers, or... There's three of them here. I'm still not too happy about having to do more of this. Seriously, when I was done with Bioshock 2, which was a while ago, and then I came back to this, I immediately dreaded the, the gathering thing. I don't know. I just don't like it. It's just tedious. I preferred the Bioshock 1 method of just saving them right on the spot. Let's at least do a few, though. Much as I'd rather not. Okay.
Wish I still had my little security bot friends. Oh, I got a turret out here. That's good. Oh, got all sorts of security out here. Oh god, the bruisers, man! I hate the bruisers. Okay. Crying out loud. Nope. Oh, he's just so out of ammo. Oops. You done? Alright. Just let the enemies come out here and let them trigger security or something. I read to you now from the machine's prediction. Sigma enters Minerva's den. Encounters hostility. Sigma enters Wall's chambers. You see? The thinker has chosen me! It does not care what I once did! Right. Another one, my god. Ah. Oh, I had an auto hack dart. That's nice. Well, now I'm out of everything again. It's cool. Huh. What the hell. Okay, anyways. Uh. Sorry, what's the code? Adam makes it hard to sleep, forgetting things lately. So this, this is an emergency reminder for the code to my <coughs> private storage area. I won't record the number, but remember, just look at the four groups of books on the shelf. And the sequence is obvious. Okay, uh, what shelf? Okay, um, oh, okay, four, oh, two, three, four, one. I like how it just records it for me when I figure it out. See, someone else was in here first. All right. Good, it's all hooked up. I can run the hack sequence from here. Just one minute. You know, this guy's voice, Porter's voice reminds me of the voice of the AI program on, um, um, ah, what's the game's name? Tacoma? That should do it. I hope. If the hack turned out right, you are now the proud owner of one homemade signal jammer. Cool. Porter worries you with Sophia Lamb's torpedoes? Ha! He fills your head with daddy. foolish visions of freedom. I can provide you more immediate concern. Oh, boy. Well, man. <coughs> Take a second deal with these fucking bruisers, man. Apparently they were all in Minerva's den. They didn't deal with too many in the main game. Or as many, it seems like. I'm gonna go ahead and do... Let's do another gather. Yeah, let's put some mini turrets down. Hi there. Wow, these little mini turrets. Pretty good with damage. I just wish you could pick them back up after you were done with them. Don't come in here, guys. I'm busy. Oh, 
Oh god. Got done there. Alright. Now let's go find a a tube thing or vent, whatever you want to call it. One down. Okay. Now, where was that gatherer's garden? Was it out in the main area? Not sure I should deal with this other big daddy right now. I mean, I could drag him back into that room with all my mini turrets. And if he's not in here already, he is. All right. Screw it. Well, that was significantly easier. So I guess that office was just a, just a uh, optional thing, getting that key, because it hasn't directed me there yet for anything important, I so suppose. So far, so good. I can feel the sunlight already. Now we just print out the machine code from the Thinker's central processor so I can take it to the surface and start to rebuild. Computer core access is at the far end of Ops. Well, we have a gather right out here. It's dancing, Daddy. Dancing. Is there any security out here I can use to my advantage? All right, you know what? Oh, Daddy, right Go ahead. Oh, I put a trap turret on that guy. Trap rivet on that guy. That was different. Might as well use them. about done yet. Yeah, I think I'm just about to go drop you an event. Well, at least next time I see one. I'm pretty close to being able to buy that key. I'm tempted to go do that. I just need to find some more money. Might be something worthwhile in there. Kind of hate to leave doors unopened. Let's see if we can get a little bit more money and I'm going to go... Oh, what's uh Also do this. Okay, health, Eve, Eve, health, Eve, pretty much all I want, um, gene, slot, is that all I can put in there? Okay, uh, I don't really need another plasmid slot, just buy another gene tonic slot, I don't have anything to use, so let's just save what I have, see, this is why I'm not sure I need a ton of all the atom in this playthrough. Because I mostly I'm just using gonna use electro bolt, and I don't even have enough stuff to fill up these slots, and um, just health and uh, Eve is what I'm most like capacity is what I'm most worried about. Okay, you know what? You go ahead. Still got another one to deal with. So if I was playing on the hardest difficulty, I would probably be taking every last bit of upgrade I can get, but I'm in medium, so it's fine. Since this is such a short adventure, they're kind of throwing an odd amount of stuff at me. Just need a little more money. Oh, I didn't even see this. A uh, hack turtle bot can... Oh. Just lets you have it for longer. Okay, cool. How did I not see that the first time? Guess I thought that was just some machinery, not anything else. $10. Is 
seven dollars. <laughs> Four dollars. Basically just roaming around waiting for bad guys. Because I have pretty much exhausted all the other money. Okay, now let's go back and open that door. Computing device in the world. I've gotta say I really have been liking the uh the level designs in the uh parts of this I've played so far. I really like seeing these old like 60s computer racks and stuff like that. Felix's office key. Hope it was worth it. Okay, I got reimbursed 10 bucks. Right. Oh, hi. <laughs> Just bash him, damn it. When you run out of drill, uh, flu or drill oil, it, uh, likes to take a minute before you can do anything. Oh, I see. We make it all run. The brains in those bots and cameras, that's us. Automatic bathysphere navigation, calculating genetic probabilities for new plasmids, health, regulating water pressure so this place ain't a fish tank. It's all Rapture Central Computing. Aww. Not that we get the recognition. Eh, <sighs> funny thing about living in the city tomorrow. Everybody takes it for granted. I mean, I got some stuff in a piece of the story, so... Alright, but I'm still, like, out of everything again. Anyways, let's move on. I still haven't seen the last Big Daddy and Little Sister, so I'm guessing they're gonna be... Well, ahead. The next section. Wait a minute. Why didn't I get in there? Was there a door I didn't see? Right, uh... The plasmid. Is it this one? Yeah, okay. Totally forgot about that. Thermal cells are so good. What the hell? Oh, that was good. Usually, I'm pretty... Except for when I talk. Usually I'm pretty good at timing these. There we go. Okay, that was worth the detour. Let's carry on. Oh, that was kind of weird. Hi. From self-opening doors to pneumatic deliveries, Rapture Central Computing keeps oh, that was it? running smoothly. God, the solid slugs hit so hard. Alright. Oh, a launcher. Nice. Core access. Here we go. Let the enemies trigger that real quick. Oh, I got a bunch of thermal. The burst cell, I can't remember what this does. All right. Guess we'll get another gene tonic slot. Why not? I don't have anything to use it for, but prefer just to get those all. It is really kind of hard to see for me sometimes. I noticed it's a little bit easier to see in the actual video. Not sure why that is, but it's kind of dark for me. Oh yeah, upgraded drill. Nice. Let me guess, we're going to get stopped and I'm going to have to take a detour, right? Ah. It's not your time to enter the core. Not just yet. Wall, you son of a bitch. What a surprise. He's cranked the thinker's coolant system into overdrive. You're frozen out of the core. Head to climate control. 
and manually reset the turbine to defrost this mess. It's the only way we're going to make it to the thinker. All right. Will do. Do I have fire? Do I really not have fire? Any chance that'll do it? That doesn't get rid of ice, huh? Wonder if I can use... I think I saw a... yeah. It's an explosive barrel. Do that do it? Uh... Maybe this elevator will lead me to, uh... Somewhere where there's a free fire plasmid. Or this is just an alternate way in. to renew your identification badge on the first of every month. Security systems are active. My goodness, it's loud in here. As well. Man, it's so loud down here. Oh, here we go. Incinerate 2. Alright. Let's put it over Winter Blast. Cool. That was convenient. It's so loud down here. I know I've turned it down in editing, but I can't even explain it. It's like this overwhelming rumble. Let's get the hell out of here. Ta-da! Rapture is at war, Porter. And you have cast your lot with the enemy. Your concerned associates provided me with a recording of your own voice, swearing loyalty to Fontaine and his gangsters. Evidence of treason. My men are already on their way. The Thinker no longer needs you. Take pride in that. Mr. Wall is qualified to ensure that it is used in the city's best interest. Eventually, a man's dream exceeds him, and his work becomes his legacy. For you, Charles, that hour has come. Nope. Oh, sorry about that dead person. Thought maybe you were tricking me. Last vacuum bot. Of course, I did miss them back in the first area. Not all of them, but I didn't get all of them either. What have we here? Elemental sponge. Bonus when my foes use elements. Well, okay. Damn it. Not that time. Hey, you wanna want a job, buddy? Come here. Steven. <laughs> Continuing input of audio data into the thinker's database. Subject. Pearl Porter. I'm recording this on the sixth straight day since you were home last. I know your work is important to the war effort, but you're not even allowed to tell me what you're working on, and that's so frustrating. London is a beautiful city, but it isn't home. I... I hope I'll see you soon, Milton. I... <laughs> Ending input. For some reason, I thought we couldn't go into the turbine hall immediately, but... All right, we got another one of these things. I gotta say, I do really like that that plasmid. That's a cool one. What? You in here doing the crab walk or something? What was that? Oh, upgraded launcher already. Hi. Sigma, 
The main cooling turbine is in overdrive. The controls should be down below. All right. Why are you yelling? It's not loud for you, is it? Oh, I was going to wonder if there was a reason they were giving me so many rockets. Man, it's loud in here, too. The irony of my predictive equation is that it sometimes requires blind faith. I see the individual elements crashing against each other, and the urgency of what I must do to maintain my part in the plan is clear. But I cannot always see just why. An Alpha series is headed to Minerva's den, Subject Sigma, and the equation states that if he reaches the computer core, catastrophe! I do not know why. Yet. But I know what must be done. Subject Sigma is approaching Minerva's den. He must not reach the Tinker. Detonate the tunnel! Okay, there's always something locked, isn't there? Um, what am I looking for here? Turbine maintenance, right down below. I forgot. Oh, it's so loud. What the hell? Yeah, I don't know about these burst things. It's kind of weird. Oops, sorry. I mean, it's like you charge it up, but you don't even hit that hard when you do hit. Huh. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Okay. Peace and quiet. That's a uh, quite the cooling system for a. That'll do. The chamber leading to the mainframe access is defrosting as we speak. Head on back there. Next stop, the Thinker's computer core. The ice was meant to send a message, Sigma, but you do not listen. Perhaps your brothers can open your ears. Oh, this is the... The little sister already. Ah, God damn it! what is that? Oh shit. Oh. Oh god. Holy fuck. Did you piss off for a minute? Oh. He goes on my health. I'm last one to worry about. So, I need health again. Find a vending machine. Alright. We're good to go. I, really, guys? I guess maybe using a launcher would have been a good idea, but... Trying to save the best ammo if I can for the moment. Should probably do one of these here. Trap rivets. You think that's enough trap rivets yet? Put down a few mini turrets. Here it is. It's like a light show in here. Dirty hair. Dirty hair. Oh, and I've got the security up top, too. <laughs> hey, you want a job, buddy? Oh, how did they come over here? Another one? Cool. I may have overcompensated a little bit for this, uh, section, but rather be overprepared than under. This angel's all 
All right. Okay. Moving on. Oh. It's a hostile couple of these guys. Does that one have a rocket on it? It does. I can't hack it either. Okay. Let's move. You know what? You want to go ahead and just, I'm done with that. I'll be good. Achievement unlocked. The equation is nearing its conclusion, Sigma. The answers lie in the core. The thinker is waiting for you, Sigma. And so am I. Are you saying we're, oh. Okay, we're at the end of the level. That wasn't as long as the first one. Well, at least... Oh, right. Little sister. Or big sister. Totally forgot. Alright, let's deal with this. RPG time. The technology of Minerva's death Come at me, bitch. Running smoothly. Unauthorized tampering with computer equipment is a punishable offense. What? Oh, there you are. <laughs> Not sure what just happened there. Okay. Whoa. All right. That wasn't too bad, I guess. Lost my little bots. That's that's sad. Okay. Anyways, let's change the level and uh, let me just do a hard save just in case. I have no idea how long the last section is, but I I am gonna do it in another video. Okay. So yeah, we'll call this one quits right here, and the next video will presumably be the end of the DLC. So uh, we'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.